Hello lovelies. Um my weekly recap vlog is gonna be up a little late because yesterday my lupus decided to kick me in my ass. Pardon the French, but yeah, it decided to um you know be a little jerk to me. So I was in bed all day, I missed the walking dead. I know, then today I checked on demand and it wasn't on, so I'm going to have to go online and log into amc.com and watch it. Okay, so if you're tuning in on this look, it's very simple, this is kind of like my everyday makeup look that I've been using lately. Um, and it's just basic, a little bit of eyeshadow. A little bit of eyeliner, mascara, a little bit of bronzer, blush, highlight, and I'm out the door. Even though I haven't gone anywhere, again, it's been another week. We were supposed to go to the Harvest Festival on Friday, but it was so cold. And being how Brandon has asthma, and Kaylee gets sick a lot. Like, she has my immune system, no lie. Like, she, last winter, she was always sick. And... I, we both got hit with like the flu like three or four times. It was terrible. Last winter was terrible. I really hope this winter is nothing like it. But we will see. We're going to leave it all in God's hands and leave it to God. That is my motto. We are leaving it up to God. Um, and basically that was my week. I stood home. We did nothing because it was cold. Um, I do have to go get Kaylee's birthday party stuff, her, her birthday, not really birthday party stuff, but, you know, a little bit of decor and stuff, because her birthday is the 27th, and then Brandon's is Saturday, this Saturday, the 24th. Woo, my baby's gonna be my mom! Like, when people were like, oh, how old is your kid? I've been like, uh, which one? I'm like, how old are you? <laughs> That's terrible. No, but he's <laughs> he's gonna be 12. Because I've been married for 13 years and I had him um, two years after we got together. So, and a year after we got married. So, yeah. Um, He's gonna be 12. He's graduating. And they haven't sent me anything about his senior year, like, at all. Which is weird. Because by this time they would have already at least sent like their senior views, you know, for cap and gown and pictures and stuff like that. So, I don't know. It's just weird. Um, I got his papers for his IEP, for Brandon's IEP. And it's November 19th. And I'll be vlogging about it. Um, I don't know if necessarily they will let me record some of the stuff. But if they don't, I'll just read off some of the papers and stuff like that because they give me so much paperwork. It's like, oh. mind you, I have all his paperwork from when I had him evaluated at two. I had him evaluated because he stopped talking on me um, when we moved from Florida. He was one. When I moved from Florida to back to New York he stopped talking on me especially after me and his dad broke up for a while broke up for like six months and we were on the verge of divorce and stuff like that but he stopped talking on me I think it was like traumatic in a sense for him I don't know but they diagnosed him with high functioning autism and stuff like that so yeah I have his IP on November 19th, so you can look forward to what an IP is. It's an independent evaluation or something like that. I don't even know. I I just give up with all these little phrases and stuff like that. Um, I need to mail out a few things. Um, I need to mail out my friends. Um, ugh. I have a runny nose. I took a really hot shower. I need to mail out my girlies um, boat order. I'm finishing up a few 
last minute like free bowls I always throw in like free bowls for my friends that consistently order from me because I feel like they deserve it because they always come back to me and like every time somebody orders a birthday band from me if it's a little girl I was doing a little bow that matches with it and stuff like that like even though it's not necessarily in the package but I always do it like I, I put like a few um, cloth bows because I have so many with the same pattern I really don't need 25 of the same pattern bows because they never sold and I put them on sale for really cheap and they never sold my website is back up hey 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 thank you David Mwah! and if you want to check out my site it is four times .com. and check out my techie tech pro is it tech pro 99 or 66 oh let me check on instagram he's gonna kill me he's gonna be like you don't know my ig like i'm sorry david but yeah that's my kid's god father and he's my bestie's husband his name on ig is TechPro255. So make sure you follow him. And if you need a website, he has his own server, which is really dope. Like, he gave me a um, green screen. I'm dying to try it out, but I'm such a ditz. Like, I barely know how to work my Canon. So, we're going to see if we can have some fun with the green screen. Thanks, David. Ah, that's my happy dance. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Okay, um, yeah, I think that's basically it. So, Sunday I wasn't feeling well, basically slept, took my meds, and slept all day. I mean, I still feel it, like, on me, like, ugh, I'm so tense, but I don't know, like, I'm just basically shaking it off, because I have this video to put up, I'm recording it, I was supposed to record it yesterday, couldn't do it then what else i have to do my plan with me i have to do my bullet journal update on my blog i have a lot to do today like if i don't get it going it's not gonna happen and today the kids have youth group so i have to make sure i have them up and ready and gone out the door so that's the other reason why i'm dressed and stuff like that. I'm going to have to change my leggings because I have short leggings, like the Korean ones. So I'm, I forgot that today was a Monday. Like, hey! I didn't look at my bullet journal. Hmm. Mm -mm. I didn't at all today. Let's see what else. <laughs> oh my God! I saw that show Salem. I saw it on a Monday. Netflix, I despise you. <laughs> no, seriously, that show is so freaking awesome. But there's only one season. So I really hope they come out with a second season. Because Shane West was like practically shirtless on every episode. It was like ah, hot, hot, hot. But yeah, it was awesome. Um, you have to watch it. Like, I'm so fascinated with witches and stuff like that. I know I'm Christian. I should be against it. But who says you can't be curious about them? I didn't say I like them. I said I was curious and fascinated by them. So I do like them, but I just find them fascinating. Like I like learning about them. I went to Salem when. I was a freshman at Watson High School in New York and it was such a dope experience like seeing the cages where they got imprisoned in, seeing where they got tortured that, the story, the history in it, like I love history and the history in it is so deep like how the Christianity was so headstrong and stuff like that. So it was really dope like to experience that firsthand and to be able to travel to Salem, Massachusetts. And to see like everything in, in the history and in the books real, I could touch it with my hands and the houses. It was just, I just love it. Like, I can't wait till I'm able to take the kids to Washington, D.C. because I'm a big history buff and I'm glad 
Ethan gets that from me. Like, we're both history buffs. Like, we can sit there and watch the History Channel. Psh, it's not there. Um... Our friend Dave came over yesterday, but I wasn't feeling well, so I kind of let the guys be guys, and I went to bed, and I slept. Yes, I slept like a baby. But then I woke up, and I started reading part two of The Strain, because I finally finished it. Oh my god, yes, I finally finished part one, and let me tell you, the show has nothing on the book. The book is amazing, so I'm really excited about part two. Let's see. I'm trying to think. I'm trying to think. Um, today I'm going to make chicken soup. We have some chicken leftovers from yesterday. He made chicken cutlets, flour chicken cutlets. Or at least I made just made the beans because he doesn't know how to make beans. But he does cook really well. So I'm trying to teach him how to make beans. He knows how to make yellow rice. So I'm hoping he can, you know, master my beans. If he can master my beans, hey. On his days off, I am not cooking anymore. Like on his days off, I love it because he can stay home and he cooks and it's like oh, a day off for me. I really enjoy my day off. Um what else? What else? What else? What else? I'm trying to think. I can't think. Um I'm hoping that when his mom comes on Friday that me and him are able to finally go out on a, you know, on a date. We haven't had one of those. It's desperately needed. Um, so yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> okay, so, um, yeah, so. Like I was saying, when his mom comes on Friday, I'm totally excited because oh, I can finally go out with my hubby and enjoy some quiet time alone. So it's going to be really dope. Um, what else, what else, what else, what else? You know, I didn't realize my ring is missing a diamond. Like, what in the world happened to this ring? It's missing a little flower petal. By passion. There you go. <laughs> I don't like stuff like that. Like when I see little stuff like that, it irks me. I didn't notice it when I was doing my "Get Ready with Me" video. Bam. Okay, so it's off. I'm gonna have to throw it away. Let's see. Oh my God, these gorgeous shoes came in. I can't show you my dress. He saw the shoes and he thought. Love it, it looks vintage -y. So they finally came in. My stuff that I ordered all that for our Valvano. Bam. Tell me that chill is not to die for. I mean, I feel like it's too yellowy. Like, I don't know. He says it looks very vintage -y. That's a beautiful color bag. And stuff. And I have a few minor stuff that I want to do to the dress to, like, you know, spice it up with the belt. It's so plain. So I'm going to like add lace to it. I'm going to put lace to it. This is like really, really plain. Even though like the whole top is basically lace. And the back is see-through. So that's going to be weird. Like, what do I wear with it? Like, I can't wear. I'm going to have to buy one of those top thingies that they sell in, like, boutiques and stuff like that that only covers the boobs and lifts them up and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, I'm going to have to get that because I can't wear a bra with that dress. It's going to be tacky. So, those are the shoes. I love them. They're really comfortable. Like, I was shocked. I've been playing some city. And I'm a dork. But, man, I'm very competitive. <laughs> I'm very competitive when it comes to games and he is so mad because I'm super competitive in like everything like when we, me and him go to the batting cages honey child he was in AAA and I whooped his butt shh don't tell him I put him on blast about that but yes yes I hit every single fastball medium pace ball like I hit every single one like I would miss only one and two and he would only hit one or two. And I'm like, didn't you play baseball? Like, 
in a league? Like, what's wrong with you? But, yeah. Hey! I'm very competitive like that. So, we started a little competition on some city, and of course, I didn't know how to play it. So, he played that first, and he had to tell me, like, how to set things down and stuff like that. But then, it was like, I got the hang of it so quickly and so good that my city was booming. Like, I have two cities, and he has one failed city, one failed attempt, and now he started a new one in a whole different region, and he's like, Oh, my city's the bombs, blah, 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 but it took you two tries to get that one city, and I have two cities in the same, my same region, and my shit is popping, so, hmm, hmm, Mr. Officer, you cannot beat me, so I'm gonna be playing that for the next few days, and seeing if, you know, he gets ahead of me, hopefully he does it, because that would be like, a disaster <laughs> but he's been playing it more than me but he still hasn't gotten to his second city I played it for like three days and yeah I have two cities in my region so I need to expand because my second city is almost complete bam, 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 bam. that's how competitive I am he hates it <laughs> I can't help it I like knowing that I'm better than him because he's so good at everything so it's like, when I know I'm better at him in baseball and in this game, I'm like, I, f I flop it in his face, like, wow. Okay, so I'm about to start my chicken soup. I don't know if I'm going to vlog about it. Should I, should not, should I, should not. I don't know, I probably will. It's just going to be a simple chicken noodles soup. Okay? So let's say my battery light is flickering. I don't have nothing else to do but the village journal picture taking, my plan with me video, take the kids to youth group, do the do the, the suit. Okay, that's it for my vlog. It's it was boring. My life is boring. That's it. That's my grand life. <sighs> okay, so that's it, and I hope you enjoyed the get ready with me video before this one. Bye, lovelies.